Hey everyone, welcome back. And yes, I am making two videos in one day. Who am I right now? <laughs> I never get to make two videos in one day, but the kids are napping. And yesterday, um, when my husband got off from work, I was able to go to Target and two Walmarts and did a little bit of after Christmas shopping. I love going the day after Christmas and um, getting gifts started for next year um, on clearance. So I wanted to show you guys some of the different things that I bought. So, so for my nephew next year, I picked up two gifts already for him. Let me see here. So I picked up both of these Coco Melon items. Um, so this here is an 11 piece set. It is a bath wash and it's a memory game place that, that can get wet in the tub. Um, so this was normally $4.98. And I think I paid, yep, I paid $2.49. So I paid $2.49 for this. So I thought that was a good little deal and these kind of go together, which is really cool. So I picked this up for him. Let me see, I'm gonna stick these right here. And then I also picked up this little Coco Melon um, set. It was also $4.98, so I paid $2.49. It's a six piece set. Um, it looks like there are five of these little stacking cups that you can stack together. And then it comes with a little body wash as well. So I thought this was super cute and for five bucks, I have a great little start to his Christmas. And kids love playing the bass. I thought that was like an awesome little find. Let's see here. All right, so this here will be for my mom next year for Christmas. It's a Lip Mosa. And so it looks like a little wine bottle and it's a lip gloss. And this here was, I think, 99 cents. Yes. So I thought this was just so cute and it's something she'll really like. If they had another one of these, I was going to get one for my um, mom's friend, but they didn't have one. This here, let's see, I thought I got a couple Mickey Mouse things. I'm only seeing one right now. Um, so this was $2.98. It's a little Mickey Mouse gift set. I picked this up for my niece for next year. It is um, a little activity book, some markers, and little stamps. They play stamps at their abuela's house and they absolutely love it. My daughter and her get together and they play with the little stamps on paper and I thought this would be so cute. She could have a little stamp set for her house and this was $1.49. Sorry guys, I have my receipts over here, so I'm peeking at the prices to make sure I tell you guys everything correct. Um, let's see what was next. All right, so this I picked up for my friend Brooke. We actually have not done our Christmas gifts yet, and so I'm going to stick this in her present. Um, it's a National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation pen set, and you click the different pens, and it has some of the different quotes from the movie. Um, like don't hog the nog and you'll crack up are the ones on here. But I think if you click the pens, there's other little sayings it has. Um, I wish it told me all the different things it said on here, but it doesn't. And this was normally $1.98 and I paid 99 cents. So I just thought that was so cute and she'll really like this because she loves that movie and she watches that every year near Christmas. Next thing I'll show you guys, just because it was so, so cute, is this little plastic storage container. It has a really good seal to it. I feel like it would keep things fresh for quite a while, and I loved this pattern. And this was like 50 cents, 49 cents. So I thought this was super cute. They had a ton of different patterns, but I am very into the red truck pattern. I just think it's so, so cute right now space and the next thing I got at that Walmart was this bath set for $2.49 so this was normally $4.98 so it was $2.49 and I thought that was a pretty good deal I could stick this in um one of my 
sister-in-law's or mother-in-law's gifts for next year and it's something I know they would really like. So I got that gift set. My store, I didn't get to go out until the evening because my husband works 12 hour shifts. And so I think they got hit pretty hard and my store just didn't have a whole lot left. Let me show you this I got at the first store too. Let's see. This was $3.98, um, which is a little bit more expensive, but it was normally $7.96. And it's the Cuisinart, Cuisinart brand, I think is how you say it. Um, and so these are really nice, heavy duty. And I actually just needed some really nice, thick um, oven mitts because I had a couple from like Dollar Tree and different places and they just, they do not withstand the heat very well. I was like burning my fingers. So I only had one really nice one and I wanted to get a nice set anyway. And this has two in a pack. So I'm just going to use these all year round. No one's going to know it's Christmas but me, and I don't care <laughs> that they're Christmas because it is very cute, and it was just a really good deal to get some nice, really heavy-duty, thick um, insulated oven mitts. So I picked up those, and then the other store. Let's see where I want to start. Let me start here. So as you guys know, I got my husband a Keurig for um, – Christmas and he absolutely loves it. He has used that thing every single day since I gave it to him. Um, I actually gave it to him on Christmas Eve just because he was like, let's open something for each other. And he was really curious what the big gift was. And so he wanted to open it up a little early and he made one Christmas Eve, Christmas, the day after Christmas, today. He's just really loved that. Um, and I'm glad because it was something I thought he could use every day. But um, I am now looking for deals for the K-Cups and they had a ton of the different Christmas flavors like gingerbread, sugar cookie, all those different flavors. I wasn't sure if my husband would like those just because he's more into like the traditional flavored coffee, like just like medium roast, like no like special flavoring or anything. And so butter cookie, I am going to try just because it was a really good deal. It was $1.96 for 12 K-Cups, um, which was a really good deal. And these are a medium roast. They might just be a little bit sweeter, so he might not um, put creamer in it, but we'll see. So I'm going to try these and sneak those into his little K-Cup stash, and maybe he won't even notice. <laughs> Next thing here, I think this, yeah, I paid $1.50. This was normally $3.00. This would be perfect to stick in someone's stocking, but I'm going to use this as a gift for one of my um, sister-in-laws. It is Bodyology Winter Plum. It's a body cream, a mist, and a body wash with bubble bath two in one. I thought these were so cute. $1.50, so they're basically 50 cents each, which is not a bad deal. So I picked those up. Sorry guys, I'm running out of space here. And then I picked up some ornaments for my tree. These, um, I got one for my son and one for my daughter, a little M and a B. So I thought those were cute and they were 99 cents. So normally $1.98. I got our dog some milk bones. He actually hasn't had treats in a while just cause I don't know, for some reason, I haven't found a good treat deal in a while, but these I went ahead and picked up four packs. These were only 48 cents. So these were like little dollar stocking um, size gift, like stocking stuffer size. And um, they were only 48 cents because they're 50% off. So I picked them up for those. And those would be something, he loves the milk bone. I don't know how many you get in here. Only five calories per tree. It says two and a half ounces. And it says it's the mini sizes. I thought maybe it would tell me how many were in there, but it doesn't. Um, so definitely check different sections in your store. Like your check your pet section. Um, check your normal bath and beauty section. Because there's always gift sets that get left behind in those sections. 
um, just check all around the store, clothing, all the different sections, just because you might miss something. This I got my daughter for a stocking stuffer for next year, and this I think was like 48 cents. 49 cents. So this is 49 cents. Oh, normally 98 cents, so yeah. It's a little magnet. This I'm gonna stick in her stocking just because she likes to have paper to write on. And I thought this was so cute. It's a little list um, and like has a little list lines and then it's also like a chimney. This would also be great to stick on your fridge and have um, around Christmas time just for your grocery list. It's so cute. Next thing I got, so my daughter has a pink little Christmas tree and I got this to put on her Christmas tree. It's um, as like a little ornament. It's a frozen stocking and it was 74 cents, normally $1.48. So she'll love this. She hasn't seen it yet because they're napping and I want to hide some of this for next year for stocking stuffers. So we don't want them to see everything. Um, this here is $3.98 and I paid a dollar ninety nine so I didn't think that was a very bad deal because you get eight gel pens there's 12 pages in this little stationery set two dollars by itself just alone for the gel pens is a pretty good deal and then it has all these little activities I thought I could give this to my niece and her um, mom could help her do some of the little things or she could just draw and color to pick that up um all right so that's all in that bag here. so this tablecloth i got for next year um if i had like a little get together or snacks or something one night um to put on the table and it's just a red truck design it was normally a dollar 98 so i did pay 99 cents for it and just because it was the last one and i really liked it it's cheaper than the dollar store. All right, next thing. These were a little bit more expensive for like a stuffed animal, but they were just so cute that I went ahead and picked them up. And these will be part of my kids' Christmas presents next year. Like, look at these. They had a whole bunch of different kinds and they, they rattle. And both my kids like to sleep with a stuffed animal. And let's see. So these were normally $7.97, so I paid $3.98 each. And I just think they're so cute. So this one's for my son, and it has like a little flannel. It's a fox. And um, I just thought this was so cute just because my baby shower was woodland themed. And um, like his little baby room had like a lot of little woodland animal stuff. And I just thought this was so cute. I was like, oh my gosh, we need this. And his long legs, like my son's just gonna love this and carry him around, I can already tell. So this will be one of his little presents for next year. And then this little bear girl is just precious. She has like a little sweater dress on with the buffalo plaid skirt and bow and she's just so cute. I feel like these just match together very well. They both have a little plaid on them. So I paid $3.98 a piece for those, which is a little bit more than what I would typically spend for like a stuffed animal, but I just thought they were so cute. And those were in the baby section. They were not in the Christmas section. Um, so I was glad I scanned those and I found those. And then, because I was looking to see if they had any kid clothing left, but they didn't, which it was okay. I got some kid clothing stuff at Target, but Walmart's prices are a little bit cheaper, so 50% off it probably would have been cheaper than some of the things I got at Target. And then this here was a popcorn tin. This was normally $5, and I paid $2.50 for this popcorn tin. And I loved this um, tin. I thought it was so cute. And the tins I actually like to save um, and put like ornaments in them, put some of my Christmas decorations in them or just different things like that. And I just love the ornaments or the tins. I just think they're so pretty. And so I keep these. 
after we eat them. And so for $2.50, I thought that was not a bad deal. They had a whole bunch of different kinds, but that was just the one that really stood out to me that I thought was really, really cute. And so that was everything, guys. So at one store before tax, I spent $22. And at the other store before tax, I spent $15.41. Um, my mom went with me to Walmart and she, what did she buy? She got a wax warmer, um, like a red Christmas wax warmer that was $8.71. It was one of the Better Home and Garden wax warmers. I thought that was such a good deal. And she got, I think, a couple wax melts with it to go for a present for only a dollar that were normally, I guess, $2. So those were really good deals. And she got just some little small body wash size that were normally a dollar for 50 cents to use as stocking stuffers i think she's actually going to use them for stocking stuffers for me next year because my mom still makes me a stocking even though i'm in my 20s um which is so precious i'm i love that she does that for me it's so cute um but yeah guys that was everything i wanted to share with you and i hope you guys are able to score some after christmas deals i'll see you guys next time bye